Hi all, I am Sandeep and welcome to my YouTube channel. I hope all of you are doing fine. In this video, we are going to build one Agentic AI application for YouTube video summary extraction. So let's dive in. So here an Agentic AI application we are going to build for YouTube video summary extraction in Python with the file data and then YouTube tools. And uh, this time we're going to use Llama 4 LLM. That is the latest one, Llama 4. And we're going to use this Llama 4 uh, LLM large language model through Grok Cloud only. And for building this application, uh, basically we're going to use Streamlit library in Python. You know, this uh, YouTube tools is a very useful tools, you know, and that is a part of the file data that enables an AI agent to access captions and metadata of any YouTube video when you provide uh, with the URL, video URL link. So in the application, it's a very simple app. In the application, user just needs, user just needs to provide, you know, only the YouTube video link, and then they just need to click on the extract video summary button. There's a button called extract video summary button. Just click on that after providing the YouTube video link, then our AI agent with the help of um, YouTube video tools will extract the detailed video summary and display it there for the user. And for that, uh, one needs to install one library called uh, YouTube underscore transcript underscore API, this one. YouTube underscore transcript underscore uh, API library. So using PV, you can install it, PIM install, minus you uh, YouTube underscore transcript underscore API. It doesn't require any um, special API key. You just need to install this library. So we'll first uh, uh, launch the app, Streamlit application and see it in action. So let's do that. So it's a Streamlit application. So Streamlit run on the name of the file as you know, Python file uh, script fidet underscore ai underscore agent uh, underscore youtube underscore tools so let's launch the application it will take some time yeah this is how it looks like youtube video summary extraction by ai agent simple app and you need to just provide the youtube video link any youtube video link and then you have to click on the extract video summary and it will uh, basically extra all the metadata information and then captions and then other information. Then it will uh, just summarize it uh, in a very nice words. So let's test it. Uh, I will just uh, copy the link of my previous YouTube video and let's see how it works. It will take some time, few seconds, and then we'll have the results. Yeah. So as you can see the tool calls, it is showing the tool calls. So get underscore YouTube underscore video uh, data and also get underscore YouTube underscore video captions. These two um, uh, API calls it is making tool calls. So, and after that, you have the summary of this video. So it says this YouTube video uh, titled build an AI blog or content writer app with a multi-agent workflows using Fire Data and DeepSeek R1 LLM. Demonstrates how to uh, create an AI application with the multi-agent workflows for content writing. The video uses the Fire Data and DeepSeek R1 LLM to build an app that can write engaging and factually um, accurate content on a given topic. And then it says that the app uses the three agents, uh, all these details it gives, and then um, three agents and what they are doing. And then it says a video showcases a simple Python code that uses Streamlit for the front end and uh, Fire Data for the multi-agent workflows. And the code defines the roles and the instruction for each of these agents. And, uh, Agents work together in product and then uh, then well written blog post we get. The video concludes by demonstrating the app in action where a user can input a topic, then click on the right 
content button and then receives a well-written article the video also provides a brief explanation of the code and encourages viewer to subscribe <laughs> to the channel and also provide the feedback captions for the video were not pro uh, they were pro don't provide and uh, is there anything else i can help you with so it briefly uh, basically summarizes or describes the video actually in, in a very nice language we will try one more video let's try uh, one more video i'll try uh, let's try this one build multimodal rag ai application with the vijay and kdva this one Yeah, here we have the results. This YouTube video titled the Build Multimodal Rack RAGI application with the VIJ and KDBI image plus text. My son, this technology channel demonstrates how to build a multimodal rack uh, retrieval augmented application using Python VIJ KDB. This application stores and retrieves both the text and the image data using the vector database. Here is a brief summary of the video. So it nicely summarizes, as you can see, the number one interaction, number two data preparation, then VIJ KDB, uh, then multimodal embedding, then stream lead application, then vector database, then multimodal search and results, and so on. Then finally, it says this video provides a detailed walkthrough of uh, building a multimodal uh, rack uh, application using Python by JN Kediva. This application has various practical applications such as product catalogs, image and text uh, data retrieval and much more, etc. So you can uh, try any um, YouTube video link here and then you can uh, within just few seconds by clicking on a just button called extract video summary, you can just get a very nice summary of this video, YouTube video. So now I'll uh, briefly explain the code. The code is uh, Python code, very simple one. I mean, just 67, 68 lines code. First, we are uh, importing all the necessary libraries. As you know, you need to install this uh, PyData uh, using pip. Then after that, you have to, from pydata.agent, you have to import the agent class. Then pydata.tools.youtube underscore tools. Uh, you have to import this YouTube tools class, this one. Then pydata.mod.grog, you have to import the grog because we are going to use the Llama 4 uh, model through Grok Cloud. And then from .env, import uh, load underscore .env for your environment variables. And then import streamlit as ST. Then after, after that, you have to load the uh, load underscore .env. By doing this, you have to, you are basically um, loading all the environment variables. Then the, there is a function called YouTube underscore video underscore details. Then you are providing the YouTube video link and then Agent equal to agent, this agent class, and then uh, you have to provide the model, model equal to grog, then ID equal to, we are using the, the new model called Llama 4, this one, 17 billion, and then uh, tools equal to here within the, uh, as a list, you have to provide the tools, uh, uh, YouTube tools. Uh, already we have imported that. Uh, then show tools calls to, is equal to true so that you can see what uh, tool uh, it is calling or what API it is calling. So it, it should be true. And then description, you have to give a brief description of this agent. You are a YouTube agent. Obtain the captions and metadata of a YouTube video and give details. After the output, agent.run and then summarize this YouTube video. And then you are providing the link here. And then after that, you are uh, retaining the output.content. And here uh, we have the uh, front end code written in Streamlit and then simple one. Uh, YouTube video summary extraction by AI agent. Uh, this is the title. And then uh, we are adding one nice logo. And then um, basically font size we are changing here. Uh, after that, uh, here we are providing this uh, link, YouTube video link, st.text underscore input, we're giving the input. And then after that, we are uh, adding one button, and then st.button extract video summary. Uh, here, um, as soon as user will click on this extract video summary button, it will call this function, YouTube video details, and pass that link, YouTube video link, and then we'll have the results finally. So it's simple code, but as you can see, this is a pretty useful application. And um, so if you have the uh, YouTube video link, you can um, very quickly get the summary of a YouTube video, what it is about, what it does exactly, what it explains um, step by step, everything. 
so that's all for this video i hope you liked it if you like please give it a quick thumbs up it would encourage me to create uh, more such videos in near future also please uh, do subscribe my channel if not yet done and also please write your comments or feedback uh, this is very important for me to know your comment or feedbacks about any videos youtube videos that i am making for you um, thank you very much for your time thank you take care bye bye